miraculous. Don't leak the show. If you do, I will kick your ass. Zadon Danny, Electro Ninja here, and welcome back to Electro Ninja's Lab. That's right, I'm back, and this video is not a nerd chat. Woo! <laughs> Anyways, guys, like I said, welcome back. Um, today, though, is not gonna be an easy video. For those of you who are unaware, which I highly doubt that any of you guys aren't, if you guys follow Miraculous, which, considering the fact that you're watching a Miraculous video, you probably assumed that this was going to be talking about Miraculous. Um, we're talking about the leaks. And for those of you who are unaware, basically, uh, I, I believe either at the beginning of the year or... In December, I'm not exactly certain on exact dates, but basically the entirety of season five of Miraculous, or whatever season we're on, I think it's five, was leaked. <laughs> Literally every single episode was leaked out into the public, and needless to say, it was a bit terrifying at the time. Now, luckily, if you are currently on the internet, you are probably fine. You will probably not be seeing any of these spoilers, uh, any of these leaks at this point in time. Now, the reason for that is actually something really good, and we'll get to that in a sec. But we need to talk about leaks in general, as, and not just leaks, but also the entirety of what has kind of been going on with Miraculous for a while. And that is the inconsistencies. Basically, Miraculous was air uh, has always had this kind of issue where episodes aired out of order. They were going all over the place, and no one was really certain what was going on at any point in time. And luckily, the Miraculous team and Disney especially seem to be taking steps to fix this as are several other companies. Disney has not aired any episodes that are after the first major point, uh, the first major two-parter, at all at, uh, at this point in time. They haven't aired even the two-parter yet. Who know, uh, I'm, We're not exactly certain when the two-parter is going to be coming, but it probably will be soon. Um... The exact date, like I said, hasn't been announced. But once that happens, we'll probably be going back to weekly episodes, seeing every single episode of Miraculous as it continues. My guess would be that it will probably start very soon, as in probably the next few weeks. Um, my guess at this point in time is before the end of January. We will be getting the first... Uh, we'll be seeing these episodes more than likely uh, when you see this video you might even be have already seen like a trailer I'm not 100% certain if they're going to actually reveal release a trailer at that point but more than likely we will be getting a trailer before then but I think but everything that's been happening with the episodes airing all over the place it's caused a lot of issues, and one of the reasons why I stopped talking about the episodes is that, more than likely, you've already seen most of the episodes, or there is a chance that you had. Because even back then, uh, even, uh, especially in the past, you were able to watch the episodes very easily because different sites had the different versions of them. Um, if you wanted to watch the actual re official releases, you could wait and then watch them on uh, Netflix or Disney, um, at least when, uh, when they eventually came to the, uh, the U.S., but due to the way that things were going at the time, that wasn't really a good option. Instead, many of us were looking for the other options, the other ways to watch these things, which... Let's be honest, we're not the most legal ways to do uh, to watch these things. Um, but there wasn't really much of an option because it was going to... Uh, the spoilers were pretty much everywhere. Which I have to say, I am really glad that it has not been that way. 
since the for this new season. The leaks, even though they went out and everyone was talking about them for a little while there, pretty much every single one of these leaks was being spotted by people who were uh, really taking care of Miraculous, cough, cough, probably Disney, and they were taking them down quickly, getting rid of them as fast as they possibly could so that these leaks wouldn't spread to the rest of the internet. Copyright strikes were everywhere for these things, and thank goodness for that. They were able to take them down with very little effort. Um, and one of the things that they uh, that also was happening is that Thomas Ostruck made a point to tell people about the leaks and told people to tell them when they found uh, where and when they found the leaks, so that they can get rid of them as quickly as possible. And that was honestly truly amazing. The Miraculous community came together to stop the Miraculous leaks from getting too far. In fact, nowadays, the most that you're going to be seeing are random leaks on places like TikTok, where somehow they've managed to get by, but I honestly do not think that they will be on those locations. They're probably only on those different locations for a few minutes to maybe a few hours as people start reporting them immediately. So thank goodness for that. Um, and that is something that is really hopeful for what is going to be happening with Miraculous now. Fans have gone from searching to find Miraculous wherever it is to being patient, waiting, looking for Mir uh, Sure, they look for Miraculous now, but it's rather than to watch it, they are specifically going out of their way to make sure that if there is a leak, it's taken care of, it's patched up, it's fixed. And that is truly amazing about this community that has formed from Miraculous. And I'm honestly extremely happy that they have been able to keep a lot of this under wraps. Honestly, I'm surprised. Like, there's uh, there's actually scenes from stuff with Felix being uh, the holder of the Peacock Miraculous that are still floating around there, but it's really freaking hard to find them. So, I'm glad that it's, at least people are still fighting. People are still l watching to make sure that these leaks do not stay. And another factor that is really amazing is that other Miraculous YouTubers, they haven't done anything. They are keeping silent about the leaks. The only thing that they are doing is they briefly mention that the leaks are happening, and then they do not talk about any of the leaks. They're not discussing them. They're not going over each and every little detail of these episodes. They're simply waiting. They're waiting for official releases. And I'm even what even surprises me even more is that they don't even seem to be talking about the official releases, as in over at Gloob in Brazil or the other channels that are airing them. If it is not in an official release in their specific sent uh, section, they're not talking about it, which to me, that is insane to think about because obviously la just last season, people were talking about every single episode as it was coming out, talking about exactly what was going on. Um, pretty much as soon as it released anywhere, other ch uh, certain channels were releasing leaked or basically copied episodes very quickly. And I think that a big reason why this isn't happening is probably thanks to Disney. Disney has realized that this is a big show that they just got their hands on, and they're not going to let it go. <laughs> they're not going to let the fan... Uh, they are not going to let the fans down. They're going to make sure that the leakers do not get away with this, which, thank goodness for that. Which... Honestly, it makes it even sadder that another leak is going on. Disney has its own original show, that of The Owl House, which has also recently been leaked. And 
it's actually in very stark contrast to what is currently happening with Miraculous. You can still see, if you go out of your way, you can absolutely still see all of the spoilers, all of the leaks of that uh, of the most recent episode. Luckily, um, next week, I believe, we are going to be getting the official release of this uh, of the Owl House, and we'll be able to actually see it officially, thank goodness. But at the same time, it's disheartening to see that they don't seem to care about a property that they already own, especially considering the fact that they seem to be wanting to kill it. It's honestly very sad. Disney has kind of been a bit of a hypocrite recently and it's weird to say the least their uh, miraculous is not i would not say that it is an lgbt show but rather it is a show that has lgbt elements in it and uh, specifically there are there are characters that are gay there are characters that reveal their relationships there is actually something that I've seen that a character is uh, someone who is, uh, there is a female character who is currently crushing on Marinette in the current season and and has revealed that feeling towards Marinette. Um, I'm not going to go into any more details than that, but that is currently happening that is what is going on with miraculous right now meanwhile we have the owl house which the main character is gay the main uh, pretty much the biggest characters of the series are in the lgbt community and or what would be considered the lgbt community and with that they are being shot down they are being destroyed the series is considered they're not releasing it as much but in a weird way they are also fighting to make sure that there are other shows that do have these aspects in their shows such as the recent willow series on disney plus honestly w willow has a lot of problems and at some point i do think that i will be making a video about it i'm just not certain exactly when but they make a point to create these gay characters in Disney while also destroying other gay characters in their other series. It's just odd, to say the least, especially with the whole leaking situation. Disney is not fighting as hard to get rid of the leaks for a show that has been has drawn in them a ton of fans very quickly um and oh seriously so many people are loving the owl house and they want it to they want to see it continue honestly i didn't think that the show was going to be too long in general but they're going out of their way to just let it happen it would uh, considering the fact that they just got miraculous and the Miraculous team, they clearly want to continue to make this show for many, many more years. To the point that Thomas Ostruck has actually made the statement that he wants to make 20 more seasons. Which, keep in mind, this season may be the final season of Hawk Moth. So, what does that mean? We're not certain. <laughs> uh... In fact, if you actually look on the Miraculous Wiki right now, they actually have something that might be a little bit of a spoiler, and when they list Gabriel Agreste, while for every previous season they have always said uh, Hawk Moth, Monarch, Sh uh, Shadow Moth, all these different things, at this point in time, they are not saying anything. They are just saying Gabriel Agreste, which... Even for this season, for season five, they still had Hawk Moth. Or I think uh, uh, they had Hawk Moth as a placeholder until it was revealed that he was now Shadow Moth, at which point they switched to Shadow Moth. And then 
now that it's actually finally revealed that it is Monarch, it switched to Monarch. But for whatever reason, next season, it just says Gabriel Agreste. Nothing more, nothing less. Who knows exactly what that could mean, but I, for one, am excited to see if maybe they are planning to do something very big, and that this will be the last season of this Hawk Moth. Who knows? It There's still a lot left to be discovered from whatever is left of Miraculous, but I, for one, am really excited. And I'm also really glad that we've got such an amazing community for the Miraculous fandom that when something like the terrible leaks happen, the community has come together, stood together, and said, no, we are not letting this happen. And like I said, it's strange. It's very different from what it used to be, where before we would go searching for anything. We would go looking out for any release. If it's an official release or a non-official release, we would gravitate towards it and watch it as quickly as we could and make reviews like crazy about this series. But since all of this, uh, since this leak, there's been nothing. Since this season started, there's been practically nothing. Only in a, f uh, a few reviews of these specific episodes that have released as they released on Disney. Which I think the reason for that, the reason why we've gotten so many, we haven't gotten any reviews until they released here on Disney, is because when they officially release on Disney, everyone can watch them. I mean, granted, it can be a bit challenging if you're going to be watching it on Disney now, but now that everything's on Disney Plus that has currently been released, you can watch pretty much everything. It's incredible, to say the least. But... We'll have to wait and see what they're going to be doing in the future. Will Miraculous be able to continue? What exactly is going to be happening as this season comes to a close? And you will know <laughs> that I will try to make reviews of every single episode that is to come out, that still has to come out. Um, I'm also planning on re-watching the other uh, the other episodes that have already come out here in America, and I'm going to talk about... I'm going to make a, uh, a single review for each of them that I haven't done one for yet, um, which, obviously, I stopped at Illusion. There will be more. <laughs> I will be talking about each of the episodes if I can, uh, but the higher priority will be the new episodes as they release. So look forward to those. Anyways, guys, I have been Electra Ninja, and I will see you guys in the next video. But on! Miraculous, don't leak the show. If you do, I will kick your ass.